Hello my dear friend, I'm Petr, your glorious lord, and welcome back to Medieval Engineers. We have an update to the game, which adds this, Structural Integrity View, which is very nice, and adds quite a few new items. See, you can see torches, and over here, fire barrel, I would say. I think this is a fire barrel, even though it doesn't really look like a fire barrel. But you can check over here, you can see that the items have been added. This is, oh, fire bucket, yes, fire bucket. We got tor torch stand, wooden barrel... Wooden chest, wooden bed, wooden table, wooden chair, a bonfire, a flag, and a massive... Is it massive? I didn't actually check for the king statue. Let's let's see if the king statue is is massive. Oh, it's quite large. It's quite large, actually. There we go. Let's put it over here. The king statue. Look at it. Look at the design. Oh, it's over here. I see. Very nice. And I destroyed the windmill over here. I got... Uh, a little bit annoyed by it, so I destroyed it. And also I want to check the structural integrity, but apparently apparently it doesn't change when you start start to destroy things. Or actually it does. See how it went red? And see how it it's very orangey in the backside, which means that it's very unstable and that everything is probably gonna go to shit. So if we continue doing this, there we go. There we go. Ah, oh, explosions. Explosions. It exploded very nicely. Looks like they improved the explosions, you know, the the wreckages, I would say. I think that's a little bit improved compared to before the update, since the game is coming to early access today. The the update was necessary, I think. I think that a lot of people will appreciate the structural integrity view the most. I guess we could build something of our own up here. Let's build a tower. So if we do this, we go up, for example, four times. See how the the bottom side is less green than the top one? And if we continue adding, it's gonna be less and less green. See how it gets less and less green? That is very nicely done. It's really, well, really, really well done. Look at this. Now if I go back down, see it's almost all of it is yellow. And then if we start adding... So, whoa, 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 whoa. I didn't want to do that. <laughs> I didn't want to do that, man. I did not want to do that. If we do this, we start adding a few blocks. If we start adding a few blocks all the way around and behind, there we go. If we do this, let's see how will how will this work? Can we improve the colors? Can we improve the colors? I do believe so. There we go. I think no, I did not want to do that. There we go. See how the colors change as you build more. The colors change. It's very nicely done. I really like this update. It gives you way more control when you're building. I had a lot of trouble building my castle. Everything kept crumbling down all the time. But now with this with this update, I'm pretty certain that nobody should have any trouble. Unless you really want to have trouble. It's because some people build stuff just to destroy them. And that is fine. I'm actually fine with that. I love destroying stuff. If you're following my channel, then you probably know that I destroy things quite often there we go bring destruction all over the place so if we do this let's see will the colors continue to change they should see see how it went yellow immediately and this one is red even very nice very nice structural integrity maybe maybe we could maybe we could take a look at the items that were added I guess we could do that. There we go. Should let's use the flag instead. So can I change the color of the flag? I can't. That is a pity. I would expect that you you could change the color of the flag, but I guess not. That's fine. There's a chair. We got ourselves a chair. We got ourselves a table. A bed. Let's put the bed over here. A little bit of a chest, 
Let's put the chest right next here. The barrel. I put the barrel on the chest. Oh, we can attach. We can attach a chest to something, I guess. Oh, player model. Oh, I see. So the chest serves to change your colors. Oh, that is interesting. That is very interesting. You can change it to be complete blackness. Let's do this. Let's be gay. Let's be gay. Let's do that. There we go. Medieval male. The gayest of medieval males. Okay, wait, what the hell is going on? I did not want to do that. Uh, F7. Is it F7? Oh, shit, I think I broke the game. I may have broken the game. Wait. Do this. Flying mode off. Wait, bring me back to the first person, you son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. What the hell did I do? What the hell did I do, my friend? I ruined it. Oh, okay. Okay, I think we're back. Okay. No, oh shit. Maybe... <laughs> Looks like we have a problem. Uh... Apparently there is a there is a problem and I don't know how to fix it my friend. I don't know how to fix it shit Well, I did kind of show you most of the things. Maybe I should show you this as well, but I don't know how to I don't know how to do that. Oh, there we go. Wait, didn't I press V already? See my third person mode went whole, all the way to shit, so I don't know what happened there. Okay, we are back We are back. There we go the fire stand is it called the fire stand? I think it should be called the fire. The torch stand, okay. We got ourselves a fire bucket over here. There we go, fire bucket. We got ourselves a little bit of a fireplace. And you have seen the king's statue. Now you can actually add these things to your castles, so it makes them feel a little bit more alive. Obviously there are no humans yet. But adding this very nasty bed i would say this is a nasty bed at least add some hay or grass onto it jesus christ man look at this bed i would rather sleep on the grass than on this bed it's terrible but this is nice and i like the i like the the basket over here the but it fucks up the it fucks up the the, the view so i guess they need to fix that i assume <laughs> i assume that needs to be fixed i'm not really sure if that's the intended thing, wait, there we go. Ah, you can turn it off. Excellent. Keep turning off everything. There we go. So it doesn't need to be on. Very nice. Very nice. So you have seen the structural integrity view. You can, you, you can see how it works. You saw some destruction. Not a lot of it, but some destruction. And... I do believe you. I have left you satisfied with what you expected, or maybe not. Timber! Oh, oh! Look at the pink pinkness, the pinkness of my character. It's beautiful. Okay, let's maybe do a little bit more destruction before ending because I think that that's my signature. You know, destroying things at the end of the videos. There we go. Destruction. What is falling down here? Something is falling down here. But not fast enough. Fall down, bitch. You're supposed to fall down. There we go. Oh. <laughs> the beautifulness of destruction. Destruction is beautiful. Especially in real life. And I love watching those demolitions of buildings. Especially failed demolitions. That's hilarious. Destruction. But... Note that I would never destroy something that is important to someone. I would never do that. Well, <laughs> maybe I would. Maybe I would do that. If I could get away with it. <laughs> probably do it then. I would probably do it that. Then I'm not a nice man. Not a very nice man. There we go. Destruction. It gets a little bit laggy, but... You can expect that from a early access title. Just hoping that the game doesn't crash. Okay, I'm going to end it here before the game crashes, so thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the structural integrity view, the new items. I think your castles and mine castle, my castles and everyone's everything will look much better with these. With fire, with beds, with chairs, with tables and pinkness. 
I shall see you next time. Getting used to Mayday, Mayday. We have trouble, Mayday, Mayday. Dead. Dead. Dead helicopter. Goodbye, helicopter.